Yes, let's get into the entertainment news right about now. <laughs> Pete Edoche advises Nigerian women. Hmm, Veteran actor Pete Edoche has come out to state that Nigerian women should desist from acting like foreigners who are quick to divorce. Hmm. He made this known on his Instagram page during an interview where he advised women to creatively adopt ways to discourage their husbands from cheating. Take a look at parts of the interview. A lot of you run out of your husband's houses. What he has used, he, he was cheating on me. Solomon had, I think, 1,000 wives, 700 concubines. If you say that your husband is cheating on you and now decides to take many more wives, what are you going to do? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. If you think that your husband leaves the house, says it's going on tour, and he's going to have an affair outside, put a packet of condom into his bag. Tell him you have packed it back for him. When he sees it, psychologically, he's going to think, this woman has my interest at heart. If it is his intention to stray, he will pull himself together. And because that you women are not even creative, no. You want to be like white women who keep marrying and divorcing and marrying. It doesn't suit us. It doesn't go down well with us. No. Hmm, if you would recall, this is however not the first time Peter Joche who been making a controversial statement he did such sometimes last year when he slammed men who need to propose to their wives. Ladies of your view. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies of East Flash, what do you have to say about this? Uh, I've we, seen a lot of reactions actually and people are saying, oh, I'm so disappointed. Why is he saying that and all that? But then... I would like to see it from another angle, and the angle There's is There's another that, angle? No, I don't know. Perhaps, I mean, because, uh -huh. I mean, perhaps uh. the way I saw it when he said it. Do you know how uh, I, I've seen people do it in Yoruba, and I don't know whether they do it uh, in other places, like, you know, when, you, uh, when somebody steals so much, and you don't want them to steal that particular thing, put them in charge of it. Like, uh. okay, you know somebody that eats a lot of meat, like every time you fry meat, you not just meet your meat there. Uh. You know what? You want to preserve the meat. You don't want anything to touch it. Give, Give it to that person. Go, 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 go. And they will not try it again. You will be surprised. You, okay. uh, no, tell the person to keep it. No, tell him to keep it now. Uh, it's a gimmick. Tell that person to keep it. Okay. You will be surprised. So I'm not talking about encouraging men like, oh, give them condoms and all that. But what I'm saying here is that a man will stitch it. And then he was saying something like, okay, uh, when you move out of the house because your man has cheated. And then another person is asking the question, that man that you are hoping for outside, how sure are you that he's an angel? No, Nothing will happen and all that. So I think it's just talking from the perspective of an African man, uh, you as know, usual. because as usual, because I know that a lot of people are saying that, oh, I'm very disappointed in him and all that. I know that certain people will not want to hear this kind of thing, like, why should you? But then yeah. afterwards, like, at the end of today, like, what do you have to say, Arike? Honestly, my mother has told me that um, when I don't have anything nice to say, to say, I should just stay quiet. Okay. Um, so I wouldn't want to disrespect such a veteran um, because if I really want to weigh in on the things that he said and his mindset and his mentality, <laughs> your future presidents, um, you, you later, will be affected and maybe they won't find me. So okay. I'd rather stay quiet, but I'm... I mean, I'm, I'm in that WhatsApp group of people that are really disappointed. And I would also say that I think I would, I would like us to go back to the days when we didn't have social media, when we just used to see these people on TV, because you respect them from afar, but the moment you hear them speak, once they open it's their okay, mouths... Okay. You're already going in. Okay. What do you have so, to say? Uh, what me I would just say is, so when the wife puts condom in the man's bag, <laughs> it will end up not cheating. Would that really work? But me, I want to ask you one okay, question. Okay, because the wife has counted, counted the robber. But me, I then want... Then you will now come back home. Wife, oh, you put 10. I did not use anyone. But you buy... My guy, has, buy, gone to, my guy buy. has gone to buy... But me, I want, want to ask you one question. Mm. And the question is, if I, if I ask you in English, the thing will not land very well. I know that women cheat too. Like, Before. it can be... But what is she in me? And also, you, the doce, um, uh, Pete doce. Yeah. I mean, this... Does it apply to women too? Because this is double standard, if you ask me. It's okay. Moving on, hold, hold because, it, hold it. Because I know that you are encouraged. You feel, you feel good right now. Oh yeah, yeah. Your ancestors have spoken. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You are vexing. If you try me, <laughs> <laughs> is it a matter of Ari Kemba OJ here? Let's move on. Let's just move on okay. because that's you should not even. I beg, I beg, you should go and rest. Okay.